Undefeated WBO featherweight champion of the world, Prince Nassim Muhammad. Durable, but even he was wobbled by that. Then a right. Blood coming from his nose. This could be the finish now. They want to stop it. But Dio's called the one to Vasquez, he can't work him out. See how many slogs that he's had over the years. The noise in the, the noise in the corner. No, I'm not having that, says the referee. Uh, says the Vasquez. No, nope, he hit the rope with that one. Yeah, he's got him going all right now. If he staggered back from that, he could tell that Vasquez. He was hurt. Oh, it's legs then. They started to go. He's going to get knocked over. He is going to get knocked over here. Because if he can't control his legs, he can't control the fight. He's just walking back into the fire again. All over. All over. And the crowd gone raving mad here, as you would expect. And the words of Warren there, I must say, did the business. He really laid into uh, Hamid and said, now this is what you've got to do. And he's done it. And again, he can back up those posts, because while he can do that to a man of Vasquez's uh, calibre, all right, we'll say maybe Vasquez. That's legal in Mexico. About over 100 Both guys have had a lot of interesting fights. The pride of Yemen. Oh, and they both get down. He got hit, and whether it was a headbutt or what it was, but he's cut and staggered all over the place. Referee lets it continue, and he attacks again. Round number two. Prince still with confidence, in control here, as Medina tries to attack. And when Medina comes in and does anything, the crowd's really a buzz. It's kind of split between, they almost want to hate Prince. He's showing one thing. Oh, he nails the former champion, and down he crumbles to the canvas. Both of these guys want it so bad they can taste it. And that's what makes it for a great fight as he goes down up for the second time. For well, knockout, still undefeated, still WBO featherweight champion of the world, Prince Nassim Muhammad. In the world, and I will prove it here. Let's see resilient previously in their careers many of them have just Mohamed starting well with that jab very relaxed he's just pumping it out and he's landing every time and, in, and indulging in a wee bit of showboating as well impressive Sheffield arena with 13,000 fans inside and he does have his way of throwing other punches from crazy angles, particularly that kind of corkscrew type up, particularly that kind of corkscrew type uppercut. You saw it attempted there. There's a left hand, that's rocked, Medea. Then a right as well. Starting to move up the gears here, and that's good stiff right hands going in. Yes, it is, there's nothing really. Very patient, Hamid here, waiting his chances, trying to work his openings. Impressive, really. Now it looks here as if he's decided that he's going to get the argument finished. Now that's not a knockdown. Just rest it, Paddy I don't think there's many would argue with that. Huge jab, and now he's going through the razzle dazzle. He's 
dancing while they're clinching. Hamid, watch the uh, use of the shoulder. Again, that right hand working so well, and this is a very confident Hamid. Now look at this, I think he's trying to do all this for the Sheffield fans. He's playing to the audience, trying to taunt Paul Padillo, who's taking all this. Once or twice in the past, Hamed has taken some sting. Not too happy, took another big left hand. This fellow is durable, but even he was wobbled by that. Then a right. Blood coming from his nose. This could be the finish now. They want to stop it. But Dio's corner want to stop it. They've rescued him. They don't want him to take any more of this. And Prince Nassim Hamed retains the WBO featherweight champion. Here is Kevin Kelly. Have a sit down, Kevin. Here you are. Let's have a chat. Let's have a chat. Now then, what, what, what have you got to say to him now? Can I just say, he's right here in front of me and I can honestly tell him that I'm going to knock him spark out. I'm going to knock you spark out. Protect yourself at all times. Obey my commands at all times. And the best man went touch up. Let's go. Come on, guys. Touch up. All right, let's do this. The inquiring minds want to know, is Hamid a prince or a frog? is on with his quickness and we haven't seen the evidence of that as yet i think the mistake he made there we Hard saw right it right there and there's the power <laughs> there's the power you were talking about Six. and kelly is stunned hey come on man he breaks so many rules of textbook boxing it's as though he not only hasn't read the book he hasn't looked at the table of contents leans his head back ducks from side to side trying to get away from punches takes a hard left from kelly there Lanza seam lands a couple power punches. Kevin Kelly lands a hard left hand. Kelly misses with the right and misses wildly with the right. Seam landing more accurately in this round than has been the case before, but taking some leather in return. Down goes Kelly on two hard left hands. Now they're even. Both fighters down twice in the fight. Ooh, a good blistering up right here. hand by Hamed. Kelly a little slow to respond here. Gets in the crowd, boo that. Hard left hand by Kelly. And a right hand shot. Leaping right hand by the Prince. Ooh. And a hard left. And Kelly's down for the third time. got a half a minute and he he's is gone. definitely hurt he's and the for real. fight is over he's for real the unbelievable prince is for real. punching power george it's a, it's almost like delahoya they you don't know where they get the power from what we just saw was the hagler hearns of featherweight fighting uh what can i say it's my eighth defense tonight i ain't getting beat basically and kevin kelly's here tonight and he's seen he's seen the skill of the prince and the strength and the ability and the accuracy and the speed. Oh gosh, you know I'm the best in the world.